I think I got one last one here. Yep, here it is right here. And this is another one from a IT recruiter here from Verpitech. <laughs> Verpitech, and they're located in Radford, Virginia. A lot of jobs in Radford, Virginia. Full-time position with Deloitte for DOD project in Radford, Virginia. Before we start, if you're just watching this, if you happen to just come in, happen to just click the link and you're checking this out, you should know that I have courses that tell you how to get into these jobs, how to get into risk management framework, how to do risk management framework from scratch, how to be a information system security officer, how to get into cybersecurity. And if you purchase any of these, I will help you directly. If you happen to have purchased it, just contact me. Let me give you my contact information for anybody who's joining us late. There's my contact information. My email is cyberaware2020 at gmail.com if you have purchased it. Other than that, you don't really have to purchase. If you go to convocourses.com, I've got a free course, the whole course that I'm releasing week over week. And I've got free stuff. Like Even the ones that are paid, a lot of times I'll release free stuff in the course i'll just say okay here's the introduction and then you can go check that out and then i have just flat out free stuff that i give out there out there okay let's get into this so this is a deloitte for dod project so deloitte is a financial they these guys are really good in financial industry they have a lot of jobs in financial so uh, i've noticed that deloitte's really been they're auditing portion has really branched out into into public and private sectors where they do assessments and auditing for different organizations it's one of their specialties is auditing so let's keep going here so if you happen to get into deloitte that's a pretty high profile employer i don't know how how well they pay or anything i think they pay pretty good like six figures and or more but I don't know like if it's cool to work for them or anything like that. Um, I would not know. I'm, I've worked with DoD a lot, so I could tell you all about that. Anyway, this is for a system administrator, a Unix administrator, and I've done a little bit of Unix administration. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm not. I wasn't the you know senior guy. I was a, I was an assistant, you know, <laughs> Unix, Unix and Linux guy. So know a little bit about it and it was on a system called iris i don't even they, it's gone now it's something else now but uh it was a linux unix bay bds based system that used to be around okay so this position is for a system administrator for a mixed and growing environment of red hat enterprise linux and solaris yeah i also done solaris too this position will work with existing Unix team to manage, maintain, deploy, troubleshoot, and support servers for a mixed customer environment. Um, this position will plan, execute, implement new system hardware, software, create and maintain team technical instructions. Okay, this is sounding kind of familiar operating procedures policies as needed so sounds like you're going to be the guru that comes in and you got to write the policies to help other people users to this is one of the things you do you'd write some kind of policy or user instruct technical guidelines or wiki to help people to do simple commands and things like that sounds like uh, this position this is not security it's not a cyber security position sounds like but you probably have to do some patching and stuff this position will need to be adept will need to be this wording's weird this position will need to be adept at monitoring and tuning system performance ongoing operations of servers hardening that's that security that's again they're not calling it cyber security but it looks like as a, a system administrator you usually have to know quite a bit of security so that said let's keep going here hardening of the servers and reporting of overall security and operational status the position will also recommend improvements to the enterprise and manage new hardware software integrations you need to have excellent communication skills okay 
Let's keep going here. Let's talk about the skills that they just mentioned here. They're talking about SE Linux. Understand the basic and advanced management and configuration of SE Linux. You need to know scripting. You don't need to know how to patch using YUM or RPM. Networking, of course, with Linux. How to network this system together and, and uh, work with our firewall D and IP tables and user management, system hardening, virtualization, storage, services such as uh, SFTP, SMTP, and network time protocol, simple mail protocol. So yeah, basic stuff with Linux and Unix, mixed environment, and then desired skills. They want you to know scripting. They always want you to know how to know scripting with Linux, because that's how you do most things. You, just, you can't always work with a GUI, so it's like you're writing your own stuff in the background. Kickstart, Jumpstart, configuration management tools such as Puppet, Ansible, and Chef. I don't know any of these ones, man. But uh, Solaris IPS, Solaris AI, Git, ILO, and Drac configurations. That sounds familiar. I've never messed with those before. So that's it for that one. I will. Give you guys all the contact information in the description below if you're interested in getting this job and they go into greater details about where this is what the company is their background but if you're interested here is the contact information it is www.virpietech verpitech.com and the direct number they want you to call them asap is 203-814-12 Four eight, and that is it. We're gonna open this sucker up to questions.